Hello everybody. I am wanting to show you some stuff today that it's not my favorites yet, but it's stuff that I'm trying. We were just in Colorado visiting family and I had gone from nice humidity here in Texas to really dry cold weather and my skin started getting really itchy and horrible and so I had to buy something quick and I bought this Neutrogena body cream, body butter and it has this, um, what does it have in it? It has shea butter and I used it, a lot of it, right away. It's almost half gone. Can you see that? And it really helped. In just a couple of days, my skin improved and felt better. So I'm starting to think this might be a favorite, a, a winter favorite. Um, but I'm still trying it. So I wanted to let you see this because this is something I'm trying. And I'll let you know if it becomes a favorite. There's also this that I just recently heard about, so I got a trial of it. Um, does it say anywhere on here? Ah, this is Josie Moran Argon Oil. Hopefully said that correctly. And it, it claims to do a little bit of everything. It's upside down. It claims to be an antioxidant protection. It smooths, smooths, <laughs> smooths fine lines. It um, it multitasks. It hydrates. It anti. It has anti-aging benefits. It is a lotion, a balm for skin, a hair conditioner, a facial moisturizer. Uh, it is an under eye. Um, it is an under eye cream. Uh, this apparently is good for everything. I've also read that you can use it on your eyelashes as an eyelash conditioner. And as everything claims to do nowadays, it will help your eyelashes grow. So I used it under my eyes to moisturize and to help um, with the uh, primer that I use under my eyes to hide my dark spots. It helped to set it a little bit better. Um, I don't buy that it makes your eyelashes grow, so I, I didn't even try that. But um, I have been using it on my hands. Um, they still look dry to me, but I also have been using the Neutrogena. Um, I also wanted to show you this other thing that I've been trying and I just started trying it and it is the Clinique. I don't know if you can actually read that. The Clinique. And it is one of their newer formulas of mascara. It is the Clinique High Impact Curling Mascara and I actually saw my eyelashes curl up the minute I put this on and I hadn't used my eyelash curler. Um, I put this on and my eyelashes just sort of went from, let me see, went from being flat like this and they immediately, ah, they bent and curled in on themselves. And with each coat, they curled a little bit more. So I was really impressed with that. This is the first time I've used it today and I'm going to keep trying it and let you know if it's something I'm just trying or it becomes a favorite. Um, I haven't really used Clinique before, not a whole lot, until recently. So I'll let you know about that. I'll keep trying it. And then this thing is something I haven't even taken out of the box. It's called Vivite. I received this in the mail from a company asking me to try it. It, it. it claims to exfoliate, hydrate, and protect your lips. 
It also says that it will define and plump your lips. Um, it is a lip plumper. You, if you follow the directions, you apply this to your lips three times a day and it claims that it will uh, it will improve the fullness definition and plumpness of your lips within seven days so I'm not sure if that means that it's claiming to permanently improve the plumpness of your lips within seven days if you use it consistently or if it's just a temporary thing. I'm going for temporary. So I haven't used it yet, but I'm going to start trying it tomorrow. I'll keep you updated. Actually, I'll remove it from the box and put my first on now so you can see what it looks like. It comes in this lovely little silver tubey. I'm wondering if it has that kind of ah, look. This is what the tip looks like. It's very spongy and very moist. So I'll put that on. For external use only. Where else would you use it? Oscar says hi in the restroom. Bark in a minute. That is really tingling my lips. It feels like I just put cinnamon oil. I don't know if you've ever used like when you were a little kid and you tried the cinnamon toothpicks or if you've ever eaten cinnamon candy that was made with real cinnamon oil. But this is really tingling my lips. Do they look any fuller to you? Because they look exactly the same to me. But I'll try it two more times today and today is Friday so I'll let you know next Friday if I feel like I have giant lips if I look like Angelina Jolie. So that's all the stuff that I'm trying to see if eventually they're favorites. So thank you, Vivite, for sending me this to try, and I will let you know. Um, I will let you know what my opinion of your product is, and I will let people who watch this video know whether or not I uh, have a good review or a bad review or a mixed review. So thank you so much for watching and have a great day. And remember, even with all these products that you apply, you don't really need them because you are beautiful. Have a great weekend. Bye.